to another video. Sorry, y'all. This was so good. I made hamburgers. Mm -mm -mm. So good, y'all. This is my best piece. <laughs> so, let me tell y'all what this video is about. Because I'm just rumbling. I'm just talking, talking, talking. Y'all like, okay, what is this video about? So, this video today is going to be a get ready with me plus girl talk. So, the get ready with me is today I'm going to be using one of my new lipsticks and another thing y'all my three nails popped off so again don't come for me y'all i'm gonna be taking these off anyway so it really don't matter but the juvia's place the red wine i can't wait to try it i just got one for right now and then i'm gonna go in with the juvia's place lip liner so this is wine too i thought it was maybe a different color but i guess not but this um lipstick is called real girl so and it is so cute like i know like that's one of my words i'm always saying oh it's so cute y'all like this it's so cute but look at this like look at it that is too cute too cute boo too cute it's red at the top, pink at the bottom. It got the little gold trimming around it. Got the little J for Juvia's. And then it says Rue Girl. This is too cute. But look at that. So pretty. So pretty. I'm going to be using this and the lip liner with it. And then, so we're going to do the red lips. That's what we're doing, red lips today. And then the hair. I know y'all see my hair. It look a mess, okay? <laughs> it's been like this all day. It look a hot mess. And so I'm I'm thinking about probably doing like a, a top blend with like a little swoop, a little swoop side. You know, some going to the side. Because I'm always wearing like the little, like you can see right now, kind of like swoop to the side, like a little hoops or whatever you want to call it so that's what we're gonna be doing today and then we're gonna do a little girl talk so y'all yeah, i'm so tired like i've been working all day i just got off probably like almost an hour ago and the kids was like mama mom you know they call me mom mama whatever but they was like we gotta go somewhere today and i was like y'all you know i'm a little tired today and it was like, well, you promised us last weekend we was going to go somewhere and do something. We want to get out the house. It's Friday. You're off tomorrow. Let's go somewhere. So, it's like, okay. <laughs> so, yeah, they convinced me to get out the house. So, that's why I'm doing my get ready with me. Um, and I was just going to take them to, like, Urban Air. And I know I stay open kind of late, I think, tonight. Not too late. But they're going to have enough time to play, okay? So, we're going to go to Urban Air. Then... We're going to grab something to eat. So we might stop at a restaurant or something. Probably like Cheddar's or something. Not, nothing too like fancy or nothing. But like, because I like Cheddar's. They like Cheddar's. I love the um, the broccoli cheese casserole that they got. It's so good, y'all. If y'all never been to Cheddar's, y'all should go. I don't know if they have it everywhere or what. I'm not for sure. But I know they have it down here in Texas. So, yeah. I love Cheddar's. It's very affordable too. Like it's very cheap. Like you ain't got to worry about spending hundreds of dollars when you go on the channels because it's very reasonable and they got good food. And they stay packed too. So and it's a nice little place, you know. So it's all good. But that's what we're gonna be doing, y'all. So um I did already go ahead and do my eyebrows because my eyebrows was giving me a whole I am using the El Maquillage. The one that I bought, I did the review on my last video. And then I'm adding a little bit of my MAC foundation as well with it. So I mix those colors up together for my foundation. And I'm just applying it. Hopefully my phone do not go dead again. Um, so I'm probably have to speed this up. I'm trying to hurry up because my kids is waiting. They very quiet in there and I know they waiting on me. I told them to be quiet while I'm recording, but I know they like how long this mama gonna take because she's taking a little bit too long and so yeah i'm trying to hurry up and get this done 
Y'all let me know what y'all doing on this nice Friday. The weather is good out here. I don't know about where everybody else lives, but out here in Texas, the weather is good for today. You know, our weather is very bipolar. So it be tripping. It definitely be tripping, y'all. I still have to come back and look at this. Now, you know. Um, I still got to come back and edit. If I don't do it tonight because I am very tired, I'm going to just edit tomorrow. Because I'm off tomorrow, so. Most likely, that's what I'm going to end up posting this video is tomorrow after I edit. Um, this concealer did not get on my eyelashes again. I'm trying to conceal this nose poo. My nose ring in a way, but it's all good. And what I'm aware is, I think I'm gonna just keep the shirt on. Like I said, I'm not going nowhere special like that. Like we are going outside, like everybody else. We are gonna, we're gonna be outside, but we're gonna be outside. But I'm not in the mood of like dressing up. Like I might throw on my little blue jean jacket something like that to go over the shirt um i have on some sleeping shorts right now <laughs> but like for the bottoms i don't know i really don't know probably like some light blue jeans because my jacket is a dark blue jean jacket and it's very cute um so for my pants i might Put on some light blue jeans or something. I'm not for sure yet. And um, throw my maybe my Calvin Klein or my DKNY little sandals, slides, whatever you want to call them. I'm not wearing no heels because, honey, child, I ain't going to wear special. I'm going to be with kids and let them go out and have a good time. Let them run around, jump, play, hopscotch. Climb the wall, climb the ceiling, whatever they want to do. Now, I'm looking at this like it's looking okay. Now, I don't know how it's going to look on this video when y'all see it. Because y'all might content. Let me look. Make sure this is good and good. Because I'm going to be looking crazy like, excuse me, y'all. I'm looking at myself recording. And I'm looking at the mirror as well. And I'm like, okay. It looked blended in. And then when I upload the video, and then I'll be like, uh, I see all these patches missing. Like, how you didn't see that? You write that a mirror me, y'all. Did you not see that? But so <laughs> okay, I think this is good. Like, I'm gonna go ahead and put this brown contour on my face because I ain't got time. I really ain't got time, y'all. I don't have time. Like, like I said, I'm rushing. I still gotta throw on some extra clothes. I still gotta do my hair. Still gotta do my hair. So yeah. I'm gonna go in with this um this Milani contour and put it on the side of my face. I think this is better if I look down this way because I got a mirror right here and a mirror down here, and I'm like I need to be able to see exactly what I'm doing. Now um I know everybody you know talk about contour, contour like contour is the thing you gotta contour but as for me like i don't always contour like i do contour like with the the bright concealer but as far as like using the uh the brown concealer to contour my face i don't always do that and i don't think nothing wrong with it you know i think it's cute but sometimes i just like when i'm apply my um my makeup and i'm not recording because <laughs> like the last video the last video i didn't do this but like oh my i don't know but uh i don't remember y'all but uh like i was just gonna say if i'm not recording i don't always use this um, i do conceal with this one but i don't always conceal with my milani so and like cause sometimes a lot of days i just go like with a 
a light wear and I know you could still use this and just contour and you don't even have to wear foundation and get you a neutral look a light look but um like a lot of times um when I am doing a light wear I don't use this and I think it's all right now that because it's new like I used to have a different one and it was a stick and it had broke you know it was a Fenty by Fenty Beauty um and the stick had broke and so I had to go ahead to Target and I got this one and like I mean it's all right I think probably I need a darker color to make it look even better but I mean, for this one, it's just going to have to work. But um, I'm really not all that into this one. Like, it's all right. I might end up getting me another one, my other Fenty one, repurchasing that one because it was real cute. I don't remember what color it was, but it was real cute. And it was, it was a, like a shade or two darker than this one, and it looked it way better. So, yeah. I'm just trying to. Um, I am going to put a little highlighter too. I'm not going to do my full review, y'all. Do I have to sit over here? Okay. Let's see. Y'all, I'm always singing the songs. Like, I love, 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 love music. I love music. Like when I was 11 years old, I didn't want to be a singer. <laughs> and uh, y'all probably like, okay, why are you laughing? So when I was 11 years old, that's when I finally figured out, like, I wanted to uh, be a singer. Where is not Santa Claus? Because I forgot to put this on, y'all. Uh, so we always listen to music like me and my sister growing up like my mama she used to stay playing music in the house like she had a radio like a little small mini radio in the kitchen and she used to leave it on all day like during the daytime she would kind of have it turned up loud and then like at nighttime like when everybody get ready to go to bed she would still keep it on but she would turn it down low but you could still hear the music you know so like if you're going in the kitchen stuff it'll be on you can have music playing you're in the living room whatever so like that was the thing for us like music and i still love music and so i don't know it was like we stopped me and my sister my brother my mama, we all listened to music, and my daddy, he loved music, too. He used to always play his country music. Like, when he used to come to our house, he used to always play his country music. Like, he'd be drinking, he'd have this little wine and whiskey or beer or whatever. And he'll play me and my sister music, country music, because he loved country music. Like, he loved Tupac, too. He used to tell my sister, like, uh, he, my sister's name, her nickname is Tima. So, he'd be like, Tima, put on Tupac. And uh, it was, one of the songs was, uh, life goes on yeah it was life goes on so i used to love listening to that so my family uh we just all love music and so me and my sister used to stay up at night like on the weekends and just like watch music videos you know back in the day uh like when music videos be on mtv and bt like we would stay up and listen to that watch videos stay listen to music like we would be in a room we're just chilling and we got the radio playing in my sister's room. I had a radio in my room. So if I'm in my room, I'm jamming. She jamming in her room. It's just like music playing throughout the house. I always sing to myself to this day. I'm always singing to myself. Like my kids, they used to. Because they always have mama singing. Like I'm, I'm going to sing some songs. Like I never wrote songs on my own. That I wrote or something like that. But I'm always singing. I'm going to play music in my house. Like, And music uplift my spirit. Like when I'm sad or down. Now happy, upset. I turn on some music, honey. I put it on my uh speaker. Um, uh, and baby, I mean, it's a party out here. Not like that, but literally, but like, yeah, I'm jamming. Me and the kids, we get to dance and my kids, we, we goofball. So we have such a sense of humor. The people that know us and that's close to us and my family, including my family, um, you know, they know how I am, they know how my kids are, they know how we rock. So We'll put on some music and we get to dancing. We have dancing contests <laughs> and we get to act silly and crazy or record each other. And a lot of stuff like we don't put um, on the internet, on social media, nothing like that. And we just give top balls and like sitting to each other, stuff like that, and be laughing. But yeah, we having a good time. So I used to always sing to myself 
when I was younger and I thought I had a voice like I really thought I had a voice and I'm not saying that I don't have a voice but I always thought like I sounded nice you know and so when I was 11 years old I was like telling myself like I want to be a singer and then like once I thought about like the environment that I lived in the area I lived in where I was from the town I lived in everything it's not very possible to blow up you know because I come from a very small small country town and so and then you know we never had a lot of money like my mama she did what she could um but we never had like all the nice stuff you know uh all the name brand stuff and just you know my mama did what she could and yeah we were struggling like we were struggling but I love my mom so much. I love her to death because, and my daddy, and because they always did what they could for us. So that's all that matters to me, and that's what counts to me. And she's always been there, no matter what her and my daddy ever been through. With me seeing it and dealing with it, and going through it too with them, it's like they always been there, and they always had my back. And especially my mom, she always been there. She always had my back. That's my baby. Like I love her so much, and so that's all that matters. But back then when I was little, I was like, um, I was talking to myself and I was real sad. And sometimes I used to cry because I was like, how can I become a singer? And there's no way to come up out of this. Like, I don't know nobody. I'm young. If I tell my mom I want to be a singer, she'll be like, okay. Because my mama taught me stories about when she was a little girl, she wanted to be a singer, but her granny wouldn't let her leave. Like, it was somebody came down from somewhere. They went somewhere and they wanted to get my mama to like go somewhere and travel and become a singer and her granny wouldn't let her and so it's not that my mama would be like oh you can't be a, you're gonna be a singer why you can't be a singer you know or something like that like she never said anything like that i told her before that i want to be a singer but she never said anything negative like that but it was just the fact that for me knowing that okay i know my mama don't have the money we don't have no connection she like my she has two brothers that um she says stays in Houston, I mean not Houston, Lord, that stayed in New York, in Manhattan, and she was like, I haven't heard from them in so many years, and their name is Kenneth and Randy Scott, and she was like, they live in Manhattan, and she was like, because they, they shared the same, they shared the same dad, uh, but their dad died, and they had different moms, and when their dad passed, they had came down from New York to Texas to go to the funeral, and my mama, she said she was like in her late 20s. Now my mama, she, I have older parents. Like my mama is in her late 60s now. And she was like, they had wanted her to come back with them. And she was like, you know, they said she would want to, for nothing in the world. They had their own music studio, recording studio. And when she told us that, no, I want to be a singer. And I was like, mama, are you serious? And I, me and my sister used to tell us, like, mom, we got to find where they're at. Like, they have a whole music uh recorded studio was like why didn't you go and this is before me and my sister and my little brother was born like she had my oldest brother but uh at the time he had recently had already passed and she was just like she had she has family out here because she's from here but she was like by herself and they wanted to take her and take her up there and take care of her and stuff like that but she told me she was like she's just gonna stay down here and then she ended up like dealing with my dad i think and he had us and i, I told her i said girl if you would have put up there you would have had me I said, you know, you would have probably, we would have, if you would have had girls, you know, we would have looked something totally different and stuff like that. I was like, and there's a reason for everything, but she was like, I wish that she always wanted to get in touch with them, but she didn't have their number. And she said they had any that stayed like a town next to us. Um, but I don't know if they only had already passed or she don't know if she was still living. And, um, let me bake my face a little more with the setting potty out. And, um. And so, but she wanted to meet her brothers again. Like, she wanted to find where they were. And even at the time, like, when me and my sister, we was, like, much younger. Like, we was trying to look up on the internet. Like, we didn't have internet like that. But, you know, like, you can try to look up numbers in a phone book and stuff like that. We were trying to do it. So crazy. And um, we was eager to find, like, you know, what it was, too. We wanted to meet them because we never met them. Like, we have uncles that we never met. She hasn't seen them over decades. And... Yeah, so, we, you know, and to this day, we haven't met them. We haven't seen them. We don't know if they're still living. And I'm like, I know they have sons or daughters and grandkids, my great-grandkids out there that we're kin to. And we don't even, 
we never seen them before. They never seen us before. We don't know each other. We can walk by each other going to New York and I'm coming to Texas and we don't even know that we're kin to each other. You know what I'm saying? So it would be very nice if we can meet them and get in touch with them some type of way. I don't know how. I even tried to look it up on Instagram. I mean, not Instagram, Lord. Tried to look it up on Facebook, you know, by the first and last name. And uh, yeah, I get no luck. I know that was a long story that I just talked about, but that's what, that's how I wanted to be a singer. Like, that's my whole story behind that. So, and I'm still going in with the same bra that I was mentioning earlier, uh, right here. Um, and I'm going to go in the most, probably like, lower, lower at the bottom. Yeah. And so, um, oh my lord, look at this, y'all. How did I do that? I'm going to have to clean that up. I think I put too much, too. Is dry, like they pillow for real. They is dry, honey. They need some Carmex, boo. Don't worry, y'all. Just get some of this uh, lipstick and probably put a little lip gloss on top so they won't be so rusty, crusty peeling. But, um, <laughs> like, look at this part right here. Anyways, I'm gonna do that afterwards. Like, I ain't just do that right now. But when I got done, I got my this done. The top top part first eyeshadow. I said, <coughs> excuse me. I said I was gonna go in with the second one, probably like up in here. I don't know. I think I'm gonna be like this. Like like I said, I'm not going. It's not like I'm going on a date. Like if I was going on a date with a dude, it'd be different. It'd be so different. Like I'll be extra, like extra boo, extra doing a lot of extras. Okay. I did want to grab my white liner at the top. I forgot. I did say that. But you know what? Since I got on this dark brown eyeshadow, I'm going to just use the white under my, uh, the eye water part. Uh, the water, water, eye, water, whatever you call it. Uh, I'm going to put that under my eye. Because I did say I was going to probably do that. So, and then I might, where's my liquid liner, black liquid liner? I can't find my Elmaki Hodge one that I just got. I wanted to try that one on because I haven't tried it yet. But I guess I'm going to just do a little something with this. I don't even know. I got, I got it. You know what, y'all? I'm going to probably just put a little bit. And you can't even tell. It's like, Mia, why are you putting this on and can't nobody tell you got that on with you? Why? Why? <laughs> why, boo? That's really uncalled for. Like, I can barely see all these big old lashes, y'all. And I always do my wing. But, like, um, usually, like, if it's with some lashes that's a little smaller, not so thick, not so long. And I can actually really see what I'm doing. So, I'm just adding a little bit at the top. I'm not going all the way across. Okay, I'm going to just go on this side. And... I'm not going to go all the way across like I did on the other one. I didn't go across, all the way across on the other one either. But I'm going to just keep it towards the end. And I can really not see. Like, it's really useless. <laughs> I mean, I know. Look, I think I did this one too far over. I know I did. Like, baby boo. It's going to be going in my hair. I just want to see it a little past the lashes. And I usually do my liquid liner better than this. I think this one is really running out. Like, it really ain't got nothing on this little thing at all, y'all. But it's all good. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. So, I'm just going to add my eye water. Water out. I want to part and put this white. I haven't used this in so long. Like, back in the day when we was younger, like teenagers and stuff, and everybody used to wear the white line under their eyes, bro. It was cute. Um... I think a few people still wear it, but hey, I'm going to be wearing it today. Your girl is going to be wearing it today. And it is a little thick, so I'm going to remove some. It is a little chunky. Let me see. I don't want it to be too thick on my eye. Looking crazy. Yeah. So you don't want to have it too thick looking crazy like like what you got going on under them eyes you know you want to have it thin you know just barely kind of running across but that white is going to show up regardless because it is white and it's very pigmented and see it got my lashes and that's kind of cute too because it bring out my bottom lashes because y'all i don't have no no bottom lashes i want some long bottom lashes 
I ain't got none. I barely got any lashes at the top. Like, I got makeup on. My lashes, like, I'm looking crazy right now. So, I'm scared it's gonna do the dog. And look at all this uh, makeup I got on my arm. That's that Milani poo. Milani is all about my body. Melania. Melani. Melani, Melana. Melana, Melani. I love Milani. Like, that's one of my favorite black on cosmetics lines yes okay so i want to do my highlighter i forgot to do my highlighter i did say i was gonna do some blush like y'all i'm just i mean i did say i was gonna come on here and talk to y'all but it's like can i not do two tasks at once because uh yeah you're talking but you're not you're not what are you doing what are you doing now I just know I didn't put that much. Now, why is it give? Why is it put that much? Cause like I don't like too much blush, y'all. Like I really don't. Like I like blush. I'm not saying I don't like blush. I do. I like blush, but I don't like to have it too powerful. Like, 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 like. Look at this. Like, like you see how this is barely any, and then this one is like. Yeah, I gotta fix that. I have to fix that. I have to. Can I move my phone? Uh, baby, we're gonna do some uh, set up. Let's see if this setup probably do. We'll do some setup. Now I'm gonna have to go back in with the foundation. I really don't want to have to go back in with foundation. So let's see how this setup powder if it would cover it up some. Because this cheek is just too rosy for me. I can't do that rosy cheek. <laughs> I'm really trying to see like. Yeah, I need a little more. A little more, y'all. Because. Mm -mm. And I think I'm gonna have to give me some more concealer because. Oh. Um, I'm not really, I mean, I like this. Don't get me wrong, I like it. This is the only one I got to use right now. Well, I do have this one. But maybe, I don't know. Maybe I need a different brand or something. Because I don't think it's getting, like, I've applied enough, I feel, under my eyes. And it's still giving me that, that, that deep look. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm deep under my eyes. It's still giving me that deep this under my eye. I don't like that. Like, I don't like that at all. It posts to, and maybe because I didn't just let it sit there. Usually I'll let it sit there. So let me let it sit there. Okay. And then I'm going to go back in. So let me go ahead and, and pull out this highlighter and highlight while this concealer is sitting there. I'm not going to do my cheeks because I want to put that, you know, buff the highlighter. I mean, buff the contour in and then go over with the highlighter. So I'm going to highlight my nose right now. I like that nose. I like that forehead. I like that chin. And I like, you know what? I was just gonna wait to highlight the top of my lips until I actually put on my lipstick, but it's all good. Yep. So we're gonna wait a few minutes, and while I'm letting this sit, um. You know what, before I do my lips, I almost forgot I do want to put a little glitter. Well, you know what? I need to wait. The I need to wait for that because yeah. I need to wait. So I feel like my lashes was getting dark and that damn concealer again. But um, so yeah, just to go ahead and do my lips, y'all. I really wanted to do that lash just so I could see how my face is looking and everything and do and then do my lips. So I still gotta do my hair, so yeah, I need to hurry up, y'all. Like, I really am taking a long time. It's about an hour and a half now, extra. So, okay, y'all, so I'm gonna go ahead and start buffing this concealer in. So, hopefully, it looks better now because, yeah, it wasn't, I don't know, it, it didn't make me happy. And I'm going to go in with this one. And this is the, because I don't think I told y'all earlier, it's the angle foundation brush to get in the corner to smoothen that part out. So. Yeah, I like the little top we had. Like, y'all learning a lot about me. Y'all going to learn even more. Because um, that's what we're here for. To share. Let y'all know who I am. Let y'all know about me. 
I love y'all so much. And I want us to grow together. We are a family. This is my little family. This is my little family. So, y'all my new little friends, you know. Y'all my new babies. I can talk with y'all. I can chit-chat with y'all. Let y'all know what's going on by me. Let y'all know, you know, how I'm feeling, what I got going on, period. Um, and let me go in with my highlighter. So. And the makeup that I did use today, it will be down in the description box. So. And it's the same makeups that I usually use. Like, I put in the description box on my other videos. So, yeah. Okay. And then I wanted to put it in the crease of my eyes. And then I'm popping y'all. And this is from my Gold Rush palette that I used on my last video. Um, It is real dusty and rusty right now. But it's all good. Because, boo, baby. Poo. Honey, boo, boo. It gets the job done. And I love the colors. The colors are so nice. And I am using the eyes to go right here the first one it is dirty y'all this palette i've had it for a long time but i mean what makeup doesn't get dirty when it's just like all this hell you use so many times you have it in a bag or in a drawer or something this bitch shook up and makeup get everywhere so it's like it's makeup you know um so yeah i my eyes a brush and i don't see it here's my finger and these nails are coming off like when I get back, when they come off. Am I just taking my right now? Am I just taking off when I get off this video? But once I get done recorded, no. They're still gonna be on. They will get taken off when I get back. When I come back on, that's when I get taken off. Yeah, so get a little more pop on this side. Get a cute, get a cute. Poo poo, get a cute. Cute, get cute. Get cute. I think I let me see. You can never not ever have enough center pop boo. Because setting powder puts everything in place, sets everything in place. So without the setting powder, what is you doing? You ain't doing much. You ain't doing too much if you ain't got the setting powder. If you don't have a setting powder, honey, what is you doing? What is she doing? What are you doing? I really don't sound like that. I really don't sound like that, but yeah, it's all good. Okay, now on to the lips. So we can get this hair did. Once again, Juvia's place, honey boo. This is the Lux Liner in the color Wine. Color Wine, color Wine. So, I guess we'll see how this looks together because this is my first time putting it on. So, hopefully, I like it. I believe I will. Yeah, so. And I was looking at the colors like, I'm like, do the colors really look like? They do. I mean, the liner does look a little darker, but I mean, it's mostly anyway, so. Honestly, y'all, like, I know y'all probably think I'm crazy, but, like, when the uh, uh, lip pencils, I mean, this is different. It's not, like, the pencil pencil, but, like, when it's so new like this, I hate applying it to my lips because it's, like, it's so easier for you to mess up um, versus, like, if you have a pencil pencil and then it's been used and it's, like, flat and all mush coming down and it gets the job done. Like, it, it applies so good. And so, I gotta be real careful. I can't talk right now. And I'm not the best at lining my lips. I know y'all can see that. And even if y'all do think I'm doing a good job. But y'all think I'm doing alright. Um, I'm not the best at lining my lips. So I don't always use liner. So that's probably why I don't always use liner. Sometimes I just put the lip gloss and go. Sometimes I just put the lipstick and go. <laughs> like honestly. Like I'm not even for sit up here and fake with y'all. Like I don't know. Every time I line my liner. Every time I come to my face. Every time uh, I wear lashes. Like mm -mm. I wear makeup. I wear lashes. <laughs> But not every time. Okay, so when you're looking at this lipstick, I love it. I really do. Like, even though I know y'all probably was expecting me to say, oh my goodness, look at that. Mm, cute. I like it. I really, really do. It is so pretty. If y'all don't have this, honey, go get it. I don't care what shade you use, color shade, shade color. I don't care what time you is. I don't care. It's gonna look good on you. I don't care. Honey, anybody put this on? Anybody? Try to straighten this liner. I wanna have to go back in and try to fix this on liner. Oh my goodness, look at that. I'm gonna be I'm walking out here looking crazy, that crazy now. So I said, did she not know how to apply her liner and her lipstick? 
Hopefully I don't be that close to my face when you say that. And this lash, <laughs> this lash, honey, I know it's waiting for me to take it off. But guess what? I'm not. You're going to stay on. Lash. You're staying on lash. You're staying on lash. I don't know why I, I grabbed the set of powder again because I feel like, I think I got a little bit too much highlight on my nose. So I wanted to, you know, like I want to start some. But this is cute. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and put a little eyeshadow on these eyes. I don't have to say sometimes you put a little uh, eyeshadow on some eyes, honey. Yeah, it helps. So, let me see. Hey y'all, so this is the final look. I'm sorry that I had to stop the video again because I had issues again with uh, my storage being full again, y'all. It's crazy. Um, I'm going to have to end up getting me a camera very soon because I can't keep it up with this every time I'm trying to record. Like, I just can't do it. But I wasn't going to have enough room to actually record everything with me um, doing my hair. I did switch my under eyes from the white. I put a brown liner under my eyes instead because I really wasn't feeling that white look too much. So I went in with some bright uh, brown liner under my eyes. Um, I did just swoop my hair to the side a little more. I put it behind my ear and then I brushed my hair up, put a little baby hairs on the sides, pulled some hairs out on the sides. Um, on the sides right here and i just brushed my hair all up into a little bun and i put a little gel and that was about it and then i put on my blue jean jacket i was talking about so this is the back of it and i still have on the same shirt i'm gonna stand up i have on some biker shorts i don't know hopefully y'all be able to see my biker shorts and stand back some these are biker shorts and just some black biker shorts like the spandex kind and then um i know y'all can't see my shoes <laughs> these are my shoes i don't know if i can see them but there's some black slides some dk and y slides y'all and so yeah that's it and then my earrings some cute bamboo earrings that i purchased online um i think i got them on etsy so i have to look and see what person I had got them from on Etsy, so I'm gonna have to look that up and hopefully I can put it in the description box as well. I'll probably just let y'all know in another video if I do find it. But um, yeah, that's it. This is the total look. So the red lips from Juvia's Place. I love the lipstick and the lip liner um, that I got with it. Um, it is in the color wine once again. And I did do me a little swoop with a kind of like a little messy bun and nothing too special about my clothes. This is something, you know, I always wear everyday wear like if I'm going somewhere. So it's nothing special about my clothes but i don't want to be like i just want to kind of spice it up just a little bit about throwing on this jacket so and some earrings this is the look hope y'all like it because i do and we the step be out one more thing one more thing before i go because this is something that i always have to put on before i go anywhere so i'm gonna show y'all what i'm supposed to apply okay hold on hey y'all i'm max so the thing that i always have to put on this is not the only thing i mean i have different ones to choose pick from but this is something i always have to apply before i go anywhere because it's just like i mean if you're not applying this what are you doing um but yeah this is what i'm applying today my libre blue ysl um i love this perfume i love it i just got it um and when i was talking about always applying i'm not talking about just the libre that you have to apply i'm talking about perfume period like if you're not applying perfume what are you doing because a girl likes to smell good like if you're not spraying down some some perfume boo what is you doing i do spray my wrist i rub it together and i kind of dabble around on my neck <clears throat> with it i do go ahead and spray down my clothes like i don't do one two sprays y'all i'm gonna i sprays down so stay tuned i love all you guys god bless and don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Okay, hit the bell notification. Show you guys love once again. And until I see you next time, peace.